Kristen and welcome back to 100 Baby. Today we are here with Gracie you guys and we actually have quite a few things that is going on in today's episode. So in case you guys did miss out on the last part, we did have Gracie who actually went over and visited over in Stranger Town and we did meet Irvin. So, or Irwin. <laughs> so I did put a poll in the last episode asking you guys who you want Gracie to begin having a new relationship, whether it is going to be Vlad for a vampire baby or if it is going to be Irwin. And all of you guys voted or 70, I think it was like 79% of you guys actually voted for Irwin to possibly get um, Gracie pregnant next. So, oh, Gracie's good friends. Okay, so we do have quite a few things that are going on today. So we do have Penelope and it is actually her birthday today. So we are just waiting for that notification to come through. And we did just kind of have Gracie um, do super efficient baby care. <laughs> I kind of forgot what it was called. And okay, so we do have Molly and Mason. So I did get them just to work on. Oh, wait, they don't have, you don't have to go. So we have a student and okay we need to make sure that they are done okay so we do have an a student so in the last episode the only thing that we were waiting for was molly to actually become responsible so we're gonna set this here we're gonna have molly come in blow out the candles because she is now an a student and we also did get all of her oh my gosh where is she so if we go down she was able to get in the responsible so she is going to be able to age up and move out. And then we're going to be able to do the same with Mason. So let's choose a random trait for Molly. And I think what we are going to do this time. Okay, wait, let's get Molly to add birthday candles before anybody takes a piece. Oh my gosh. Um, Add birthday candles. That was terrifying. <laughs> so I think we are going to have Molly and Mason get a job before we move them out. Just so we can kind of like watch their story. So Mason's going to come over and he also does have the responsible trait as well. So they're going to be able to move out. So Ken has sent a gift. Okay, wait, no, you need to blow out the candles. Why do you not want to blow out the candles? Okay, Molly, you need to move out of the way. Maybe if we move this. <gasps> What? <laughs> Did I just put the freaking birthday cake in the dishwasher? What the freaking heck? Okay, um, do we have the kids? Okay, they're to school. Let's get them to study hard. I can't believe that I just freaking did that. Okay, I'm pretty sure we don't have any more cakes here. Dang it. Okay, so Mason's gonna have to cook up a birthday cake. Dang it. Why would I do that? Let's do a white cake this time. I can't believe I did that. And then we're going to have Gracie actually call over and invite to hang out. Let's actually invite over Erwin just so that we can continue working on the relationship because we are going to be having um, Mason and Molly actually move out. And then we will be able to have a baby. So I'm actually really excited for that. Mason, what the heck? Why do you want to keep going to sleep? Okay, Erwin will be right over. So let's bake. Oh my gosh. This annoys me. We do not cook a cake. You bake a birthday cake. Okay, so let's get a cake going here. Okay, so there he goes. Gracie should probably come over and do some cleaning. Now, I am going to keep an eye out for the butler, you guys, because I think we are going to fire him. A lot of you said that he really doesn't seem to be doing too much. Oh, let's make a flirtatious joke. So, yeah, a lot of you guys actually said that you didn't think the butler was really worth it. I mean, he just kind of sits around. He doesn't do really any chores. And he is an elder. So, if he actually dies or passes away at our home, we're going to kind of have a little bit of an issue with that because our Sims are going to want to be, like, really sad about it. Wait, I don't even see. Maybe he's not even here. Okay, so we have Erwin here. We're going to continue just kind of maybe we'll give him the keys so he can maybe hang out here oh i think that was the gardener asked to leave no let's do we're gonna keep on being romantic with him we're gonna flirt a little bit oh my gosh will you resume the white cake what in the heck no we don't want to go to school today let's put this there why is there two white cakes here what is going on 
Okay, maybe we'll just have Gracie make this. He doesn't seem to want to actually like do anything with it. Let's put that out of the way. Gracie, a winter fest. Starts tomorrow. Oh my gosh, is it winter time here already? And Gracie has learned that Erwin is erratic. Okay, so yeah, we food fight will lower some empathy. So let's get that going. Now, let me double check on the children. Okay, so we can prom be promoted. Dang it. Okay, so Nelly is not going to be able to be promoted today, but we really do need to get working on some of the skills here with the kids. So I think we will continue. Let's go over here and let's play dolls with, let's play with Molly. And okay, yeah, we'll just do Molly. And then we're going to get Oliver to, let's do Potty. We'll get him to get working on that. And is the cake done? Almost. Mason, what the heck? Okay, I think we're going to have to like reset him. Maybe he can come over, sit here for a minute. We should probably get rid of this cake. Oh my gosh, what are we going to do? We have too many things. <laughs> Erwin, oh my god. He has been bugged, you guys. In the last episode, I did see the radar coming off of his back. So somebody is definitely paying attention to Erwin and trying to find out what he knows about Strangerville. I love that. Oh my gosh, we're hysterical. Definitely need to pay attention to that because if you guys have been here since April, I don't know if you remember, but she actually died from laughter. <laughs> so I really do want to pay attention to um, make sure she doesn't die. That unfortunate. Are we almost done? Okay. And let's set the cake down. Add birthday candles. Oh, we need to... Oh my gosh, don't you dare. Okay, let's have Mason come over, add some birthday candles, and he'll be able to age up. So he is going to be moving out. Oh my gosh. And you can now blow out the candles. Do I hear a baby? Okay, let's go over and let's feed, feed our baby. And Mason has now aged up. So let's give him a completely random trade as well. So he is foodie, Jesse. Everybody is sending over some gifts. We're going to have Gracie go in, tend to the baby, and we're also going to get the Mason and Molly a job. So let's do find a job for Mason, and then let's find a job for Molly as well. And, oh, Molly, you need to, like, go here. Okay, so for Mason, which do we want to do? An actor, detective, doctor, scientist gardener I mean I think we could have him start the military I think we'll have him register for that and Molly you need to leave work assignment okay so he is going to be moving out so I feel like that is just going to really help their story and okay you need to like move Molly okay so Molly I think we are going to have her go into actressing just because I want to you know see what she can do with that a little bit more and let's do that agency. We are going to breastfeed joined AI staffing. Okay, so let's have Gracie go in there. So the good news is we are going to be able to try for a baby in the next episode. I don't know if we can now. Woohoo. I mean, we could do that. We don't have enough space in here right now to actually try for a baby. But we could woohoo just so that we possibly can um, work on our relationship for the next part. So let's add some birthday candles and then we can actually like put that away. Okay, so they're going to be able to move out. How are the toddlers making out with their skills? And just kind of waiting still for the baby Penelope to be able to age up. So let's do, where are the computers because we do need to get working on our thinking skill but I guess we could go in go potty Mason you might as well come in and actually like clean this up for us and then who do we have Oliver wants to go potty Ollie let's work on communication with him oh my gosh they're actually making really good progress so we have it's Penelope's birthday so the time just flies by okay so we can have Gracie come in we are going to be aging up little Penelope. Age up. Oh my gosh. I can't wait to see what she is going to look like, you guys. Like, how cute is she? <laughs> 
Okay, and hopefully all of her needs are gonna be pretty far up just because we have been giving her like a lot of attention. Oh my gosh, Gracie's woohooing. I completely forgot about that. Oh my gosh, Erwin, we have smoke. Okay, so some people love art, but everyone loves a popular artist. You're the talk of the town. Okay. I mean, Gracie really hasn't done that much for like doing her art and stuff like that. So, Molly. Wait, what are the toddlers doing? Okay, is that cleaned up? No, we don't want you to make a mess. Oh my gosh, has he made a mess? Because I don't want to have to actually like <laughs> go over and yell at him. Okay, so we are going to be closing our eyes and choosing a random trait for Penelope. So Penelope, I didn't even click anything. So Penelope is going to be Charmer. Okay, that's a good one. So what does Pen <gasps> Look at Penelope, she has that orange hair. Oh my God, she is adorable, you guys. How adorable is Penelope today? Okay, so we have another toddler. We have no more babies, so we will be able to have Gracie get working on that. Oh no, our... Good thing we have like a lot of money. Do we actually have a money tree? Can we harvest this today? So we have that, everything is working. Do we need to feed, research, take a cutting, purchase, dang it. I don't know where our slip went because we did take a slip of the money tree in one of the last parts, but let's do bond with the bees. That'll work. Oh my gosh. And patchy. Okay. So Penelope has acquired the movement skill. So we're definitely going to need to get working on that with her. And what time is it? Okay. We have about an hour before the other kids do come home. So I guess we'll have Mason come over. Mob like mad. He's having an issue. <laughs> and Penelope. Okay. I think we'll have Penelope come over and we can join playing dolls just so we can actually like get her working on her skills as well and how have these toddlers made out okay so we really don't need don't need to dance we do need to get working on that thinking skill a little bit so let's do some shapes and yeah we'll work on that imagination okay and for oliver oliver does need to get that potty up into a three so we'll do that a couple of times as well Oh my gosh, cake on the floor. <laughs> what in the heck? Okay, Mason, what can we do over here? Harvest, six um. We can sell those. Oh my gosh, this thing is so creepy, you guys. It's like collecting all of the spiders and bugs. So weird. <laughs> so creepy. Okay, so Penelope is playing dolls. And what else could we get her to do? She could, I guess, play by herself because we are going to need to get working on her skills. So let's put this. Oh my gosh. Okay, Molly. Might as well make up another cake. And I don't think the toddlers... Oh, no. Oh, the kids are home. Okay. Sounds promising. Where are they? And no rainbows, unfortunately. Okay, so school is out. So Nellie is now a B student. Nicole swiped an object while she was at school. Oh my god, you guys. Nicole is a kleptomaniac. <laughs> so that's a little bit awkward. And Nicole is also a B student. So we do need to get them working on their homework. So let's get started with your homework and your homework. And how is this skill? Okay, so we definitely do need to get that up into... A level three and okay everybody is doing good you guys and I think that is where we are going to be ending today's episode of 100 baby you guys in the next part we are gonna have a ton of stuff going on so we do have Molly and Mason who are gonna be leaving our home which is going to free up two new spaces for babies so we are gonna try with Erwin and we also will be able to try with Vlad as well so make sure that you guys do start leaving all of your baby name suggestions down in the comments below to possibly be featured in an upcoming episode of 100 Baby. And make sure to give today's video a very big thumbs up. It always lets me know you guys did enjoy. And hopefully I'm going to see you all next time. Bye guys.